Hey, what is going on everyone and Merry Merry Christmas to all of you over the entire world. Today I will make the easiest tutorial to follow if you want to update your TWRP to the latest version available. Pay attention, I said if you want to update your TWRP. That means you already have a TWRP version and eventually root installed on your device. In my case, I'm using a rooted Galaxy S8 G950F with TWRP 3.1.1-2 and I will update it to the latest 3.2.1-0. If you don't have TWRP installed on your device and your device is different than a Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus, Google it on how to install it because the procedure may vary from device to device. Otherwise, I have a detailed and fully working separate tutorial on how to flash WRP and root on your Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus for the first time showing up right now into the card section. So if you already have WRP installed on your device, let's get right into the tutorial. Open up Google Play Store and search for the official TWRP app. Install it and tick all the boxes available. Then head to TWRP Flash. Select your device by writing its name, in my case it's the Samsung Galaxy S8 and select your exact model. In my case, it's the Exynos Dream LTE. You'll get a list with all the available TWRP versions. You'll have to download the latest .emg file. Pay attention, not the .tar file, the .img one. In my case, it is 3.2.1-0-dreamlte.img. The download will eventually start. Now, go back to the main menu into the TWRP flash section and select a file to flash. Usually, the previously downloaded .img file was stored onto the root of your internal storage, in my case, slash emulated slash zero. Scroll down and you'll eventually see it. There is a link in the description if you encountered an error and you weren't able to download the img file. Now, select the downloaded img file and then click the flash to recovery button. The installation procedure should begin and finish in a couple of seconds. Now, if you want, you can check whether your TWRP was updated or not by getting into recovery mode. As you can see, mine got updated. If so, reboot your device and you're done. But what if your TWRP didn't update? That means that you ran into some problems. In that case, you can manually install the updated TWRP version by going into install, then install image, select the downloaded.img, and flash it on the recovery partition of your device. Now, go back and reboot again into recovery and by now you should have completely updated your TWRP to your desired version. Now you can safely reboot your device. Anyways, this was the tutorial for today. I hope I helped you updating the TWRP on your devices. Happy holidays and Merry Christmas to all of you. If you like my video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and activate the bell icon so that you'll be notified with all my uploads. This was Wicked and you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Let's Get Wicked and on Google Plus at Wicked is here. Until next time, as always, take care. Wicked is out. Bye bye.